on our third year of the Mason B. Bungalow Lending Program. I provide a 60-minute lecture, which is uh, people can register for in January and February. Unfortunately, it's full and underway at the moment, but I am always taking people's names. I'm happy to add you to next year's list. Um, after you uh, learn the basics of the bee life cycle and how to maintain a house, you're eligible to take our little uh, bee house home. I'll teach you exactly where to hang it. And then we go on a one-year journey together. I will send you an e-newsletter um, asking you to observe certain things or um, to, I'll, you know, I'll just send you notes and together we'll observe the life cycle your bees will stop flying in June and they will overwinter in the house and the fun part of this program is I invite you back a year from now and we have a cocoon washing party. Everyone's invited to bring their little lending houses back. We open up all the tubes, we wash cocoons, we learn from each other. Some people will succeed, some won't do as well, but we'll figure it all out together everyone goes home with their little washed cocoons and they can start their own larger colony. You return the house to me, I give it a little spruce up and I send it out to the next group of um, West Van Memorial Library B patrons. This program not only provides safe, clean habitat, I ask all of my uh, participants to commit to raising these bees and learning as much as they can to provide very healthy habitat. I think it's important. We as humans tend to think and jump, I think jump before we think, best intentions, but these houses can become quite hazardous to bee health if not looked after properly. But we really build a community here at the library. Everyone can ask each other questions. They have some place to go if they run into problems, and I think that's what excites people. And once you're part of our program, you are part of the alumni, so you can continue to come to our cocoon washing parties. You always have someone to ask a question of. If I can't answer it, I know people who can.